thing. So we decided um, after losing her that the best way to honor her life was to honor, honor the animals that she loved. And, and we have another photo here with yeah. her and the little pup there. That's and Sammy. Sammy. And, yep. and you still have Sammy at home? No. Unfortunately, um, we had to put Sammy oh, okay. to sleep the week after we lost Catherine, so oh. they're together. Oh. Yeah. Well, that's, yep. that's, that's, that's very good. And, and she was also a, a big fan of, of butterflies, right? Oh, my gosh. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. She would try to catch them. Every, as soon as she saw one, she would take off after it, thinking that she would catch it. And by the end of um, spring, summer, we'd see her sitting in the, in the uh, gardens. And she'd be able to have them land on. She realized once she calmed down a little, they would come so to cute. her. Yeah. And, and we're going to be talking about her butterfly yeah. party that we have coming up this Saturday. Uh, but first, let's, let's talk about Dawes a little bit, what, what you guys are doing uh, with our buddy Starsky here. Well, Dawes is proud that the Catherine Hubbard Sanctuary reached out to us to be part of their event on Saturday, and we're going to be one of many rescue groups and shelters that will have dogs and cats available for adoption. And this is Starsky. He'll be there Saturday. He's a one-year-old cat who's looking for his home, and, and Chico, a four-year-old mini pincher, is also looking for his home. So cute. Although, I don't know, he might not make it out of the studio today. He no. seems to have a fan club <laughs> already. <laughs> Um, and let's, let's talk a little bit about the sanctuary. Yeah. You, you, you guys are doing great work here. I mean, uh, it's, it's all about compassion, acceptance, and determination. And we have a photo here of, of the plans for the sanctuary. Yep. We have been just surrounded by so much generosity and kindness. Um, and the architectural firm, PH Architects, has, came forward very early on and said that they were, gonna, they were committed to helping us fulfill the dream of building a place where all creatures know that we're kind and that they're safe. And so they did the renderings. They've designed, uh, they've assembled a design team pro bono. Wow. And um, just last fall, the state of Connecticut conveyed 34 acres to wow, the foundation.